Jeannie, and this is the do-it-yourself pocket bat mitzvah invitation suite from Birchcraft Studios. This modern invitation features a Star of David, which is made of smaller stars in varying colors at the top, and your wording prints below. The invitation card is digitally printed on smooth ice shimmer stock and mounted inside a purple shimmer metallic pocket. A tab on the front displays the name of the bat mitzvah with a matching design. Because this invitation is in the do-it-yourself collection, you can select the paper and pocket colors for more than 50 possible combinations. The enclosure items print on single matching cardstock, and the matching informal notes print on folder stock. This invitation comes with single bright white envelopes, we show it here with an optional return address on the back flap. You may purchase this invitation ensemble at invitationsforless.com. To prepare this invitation for final assembly, have the pocket, the invitation card, the name tab, and your supply sheet of glue dots face up in front of you. First, we're going to pick up the glue dots and peel one of those off. And what these are are little round circles with the tab and there's double-sided adhesive on the back. So go ahead and position it in the upper left-hand corner of the pocket. Press it down and peel it off. Then we're going to move on and repeat the process for the upper right-hand corner. Press it down, peel it off. Then pick up the invitation card and carefully position it so it's nice and centered on the pocket. Press it down, close your flaps, and then now we're going to place this little name tab right here. So again, position it, um, the little sticky dot, in the center of the V. Press it down, and then center the tab, and we're ready to move on to final assembly. To complete the assembly process for this ensemble, have your completed pocket invitation and all of your enclosures along with the envelopes face up in front of you. The enclosures print on cardstock in varying sizes, so go ahead and place them together like this so you get a nice stacked appearance. Then insert those into the pocket, and then I like to take the response envelope and place that behind so you don't lose that nice stacked appearance. Close the pocket and insert it into the envelope so the front of the invitation is facing the back of the envelope. Close your flap seal it, and you're ready for mailing.